Okay, in this video, we're just going to look at using the sine rule. Now, this is the sine rule up here. And I use the sine rule in non right angled triangles to find a missing side or a missing angle if I have two sides and two angles and one is missing. So in this case, I have two sides, the 10 and the x, and two angles, which are the 85 and the 50. One of them I don't know, which is the x. I'm going to take the first formula, and I'm going to take this a number, I'm going to replace it with x, and I'm going to divide it by 50. Now, how do I know it's 50? It's simply the number, the angle, that is opposite x. So this a and this a, there's the side and the angle opposite. And then it will equal this side, let's just call that one b, there's the side B and the angle opposite, so we put in sine 85. So we start off by writing that out, and that will certainly get us two marks. And that's the number 10 there. <coughs> so to work that one out, I rearrange it. I make it 10 times sine 50 divided by sine 85, and that will get me my correct answer straight away. Just one thing, I need to be very careful about how I put it into the calculator. I'm going to put 10 times sine 50, and then execute, and then divide it all by sine 85. And you notice at the top of my screen, I'm in degree mode. So I've got x as 7.69. So that's how I find the missing side. 